Zilria back again with another episode of the Sims 4 Drifter Challenge. We're on house one with Lily Stormstout. Last episode, we were able to age up, age up our heir, Asa. Um, and the theme of this episode is family gardening. Um, I'm so excited. Um, I know in a previous episode, I had inquired about whether or not um, we were able to like if teens were able to garden, um, if we did the group gardening thing, and the answer is yes. <laughs> I figured it out myself. I didn't even wait for anybody to answer. I just tried it, and it worked. Um, so hopefully this will give um, Asa a little head start on her gardening skill, and it will really help Lily out in taking care of the garden. Um, so we've done a couple of things off stream, I or off video. I did, um, or before I started to film this video. I did um, make a few changes to the house. Um, when Asa aged up, her bed wouldn't fit in her little room, um, so we moved her into the basement. Um, I got some changes there, and so I'm going to go ahead and give us a tour. So let's get started with drifting. Okay, so here we are in our house. Um, you can see, oh goodness, the potty's dirty. Um, you can see up here that we changed this into the office. Now there's a little chessboard and the computer is up here um, and we've moved Asa downstairs. So we did remove the door um, here. So now this is just kind of a private bathroom for them. And I did actually lock the doors. I really hate it when um, the Sims use bathrooms I don't want them to use. So. Um, you know, if this was my master bathroom, nobody else would just come into my bathroom and shower. So I went ahead and locked that so that didn't happen. Um, I did make a little change in here so that I could afford a shower down in Asa's room. Um, and so I just put this cabinet in here so it didn't look so strange and moved the shower downstairs. I ended up actually selling the shower because I didn't have enough then for a toilet and a sink. So I ended up just selling it, adding a little bathroom down here. Obviously it will get a little bigger um, as she gets bigger. And here is her little room. Let's put the walls up so you can take a little look around. She still has a lot of her um, childhood memory stuff on her walls. Um, and obviously she needs a shower from all of the gardening. But we got her this cute little bed and it's comfortable and she's enjoying sleeping on it. And so we're doing well there. Um, also, I accidentally checked the mail um, while I was drifting and I wanted you guys to see before I did anything with it um, that we did get a lot of our elements. I didn't touch them. I checked the mail right before I started um, recording. So um, as you can see on the collection, we did um, get, oh, I guess I can't show you now because it, can I show the past ones? I don't know, I guess not. Well, either way, we <laughs> completed the last um, leg, I guess, of the this trait or this uh, aspiration. And now we need to complete a collection, which that's gonna be super hard because I didn't know that we were looking for it before. So <laughs> yeah, that's gonna be hard. So. 25 collectibles. Um, collectibles can be found in many places, including in logs, under rocks, and by using the observatory. Well, that's interesting, I didn't know that. But um, apparently we only have one collectible right now. Um, I don't know how that happened. I mean, we have a whole lot of stuff. Ooh. We're almost done with the frogs. Um, collections complete one out of 23. Oh my gosh, it wants us to collect all 25? Collectibles, wait, oh, one out of 25 collectibles, I don't know. Complete a collection. This is very confusing. So have we not completed any collections? I guess not. Nope, so what is this thing? Okay, so we're almost done with the frogs though. So I think that that is the one that we're gonna have to do. So this one's a rare frog. And then two uncommon frogs. It's nice that it seems to have completed it um, even though we sold them. So that's really nice. And then we only have a few metals we haven't found. So one, two, three metals we haven't found. Okay, so what is this collectibles thing? What 
are the collectibles? I don't know if we're going to finish this, but it's not a nece it's not necessary. It's just something that we wanted to add. Um, I think, I hope. Oh Lord, I better check. Oh my gosh, I hope that that's not something we were supposed to do because I'm going to cry if we were supposed to finish that. Oh gosh, I better check. Okay. I suppose I should have paid more attention to the rules of House One. Um, so we have to pick an aspiration, and it says we can change the aspiration. Um, the goals. Okay. Whew. Thank goodness. Okay, so for the first house, we don't have to finish the aspiration. Thank goodness. But for house two, we do. So in house two, she does need to complete the outdoor um, thing. Okay, good heavens. Okay, so let's get started. <laughs> now that we've had a little bit of a panic, we're doing okay. Um, so where is Lily at? Uh, let's put the walls down and we'll get started here. So she's getting her fun up. Um, right before we started this, we were able to, um, we did do the, family gardening and so we were able to harvest everything in the backyard and so we don't need to worry about our backyard for a while um, we also did do um, some family gardening and so that was really nice what did that just say we did oh now we have found oh oh okay so these things that we pick up are collectibles? Good lord. Okay. It's awfully weird. So just picking up seeds counts as a collectible? Okay, well this aspiration is much easier than I thought. You guys that have all done this are gonna watch this video and you're gonna be like, oh my gosh, she was freaking out about the craziest thing. Yeah. <laughs> um, so we just need to complete our frog collection and then we finished our aspiration, so that's good. We might have to travel around. Um, I don't know if the couple of frogs that we need are available everywhere, so we might have to travel around. I don't know. Or it might just be the luck of the draw. It is nice that with the frogs, since, apparent, since we're selling them, that it is keeping the fact that we have um, acquired that frog we just haven't we just don't have it anymore um, with the elements collection when I was doing the not so berry if you took it out of your inventory it no longer even showed that you had gained it maybe that's a curator thing that it allows that to happen okay so now that she is on her way home she's very tired um, we're gonna go potty we're going to grab something to eat. How about this blackened bass serving that's in the fridge already? And then we can head up here and go to sleep. And while she is sleeping, we will... Oh, let's not sell that froggy yet. We'll go ahead and sell everything. Um, I think that now that we've done that portion, we can go ahead and sell the elements. Um, I don't think that we're going to need them anymore, but let's just look at our frog collection. Uh-oh. I thought that we had all the frogs just a minute ago. Oh! We found that rare frog. That we were okay, so we have one rare frog and three uncommon frogs. Why does it say seven of 23? Oh, because we're working on seven of the 23, maybe? We've almost complete, oh my gosh. We've almost completed this collection. So that's good. We've gotten a lot of the elements. Okay, that must be what it is, is that we've started seven of the 23 collectibles. Surfer eggplant frog is cute. Oh. Let's look at 
this frog. Okay, sell this stuff for eggplant frog. Ugh, what are you doing with my inventory here? Oh my gosh. I'm like grabbing things that I don't mean to grab. Okay, so let's breed this frog. Asa, honey, go to bed. Okay, we're gonna sell all these elements. Those, we don't really need them. We're not completing any crazy collections like that, so that is fine. Um, we can do this, we'll sell this. Sell these carrots and the grass. <laughs> Lettuce, I guess that is. It's not grass, we're not harvesting grass. That'd be silly. Okay, so I think that that is all good. Um, let's put this in the sink. Okay, and we can sell this too. Okay, now let's speed this up. We've almost completed a collection. Getting close. So we still need four frogs. Maybe we'll try to travel and see. When we hired that gardener, was that gardener, like, gonna come all the time? Because I have never seen that gardener since the day we hired the gardener. <laughs> since that one day when we hired the gardener, I've never seen the gardener again. So, that's weird, but okay. Okay, so how is Lily feeling? We're on Lily, perfect. Uh, when you wake up, how about, no, let's not take a shower, actually, because we're going to go drift. So, um, we'll go potty, and then we'll just send her out to grab things. No, Tyriel, we're busy. And then maybe we'll, I'm wondering if we should, yeah, let's try to travel about a bit. Um, and see. So I'm going to come get that frog. And then we're going to go on a little travel. And maybe go over to the park or something. And see if we can find some different frogs um, that are available. Because maybe the fro there's some frogs that are only available in certain places, you know? I've never done any collecting. So, except for in my Not So Berry Challenge. And that was a nightmare. So... I'm hoping that this frog hunting won't be like that. So let's go ahead and do that. And then we will take a little travel after she gets this frog. Um, and go to another park around here. And see, oh, I don't want to do that, but okay. Uh, let's travel, just you. A sunflower frog where we've gotten that before. Okay, so I just want to go to the big park and we'll have to wander around a bit. So maybe we'll grill some fruit since she's hungry. Um, and I think that this is where we want to try first. We're going to grill some fruit and see um, what we can come up with as far as looking for frogs. There's also a couple of other places um, that I have seen frogs about. Um, so in the comments when this video airs, um, it's possible that I will have already figured out where I needed to go um, to look for some more frogs. But if you guys know any wonderful areas that have frogs, please let me know. I would appreciate knowing. Um, so how about you come over here and we're going to grill some grilled fruit. That will be good. And while you're doing that, oh, here's a frog spot. We're gonna look for frogs here. And there's a lemon tree just growing in the middle of nowhere. Okay, I don't see any other froggy spots around here. But while we grill fruit, we might come upon, I mean, some frogs might spawn froggy holes might spawn so I will keep a lookout oh, people are showing up to fish don't really see anything else but we might as well nope none of this stuff is ready to harvest 
So after we get that frog, um, I'll take another look around and see if there's anything else to grab um, and if there's any more frogs to grab. And if not, we will move on to the next place. We'll just travel about today and make this a little bit of a travel and look for frogs day. Okay, obviously you need to come back here and grab a serving and then put that in your inventory. Ooh, a dirt surfer frog. I don't think that's what we need. Ooh, it is uncommon though. I hope we've already had it. It's not rare. We need a rare frog. Oh, we're gonna go chat with someone. Okay, let me just take a little peek around and see if there's any froggy spots before we move on. Um, I think that we need to try some areas a little closer to some water. Okay, so let's take another travel. We're going to travel by ourselves. Let's see if there's another place close to some water. Uh, Grandpa's place? I don't know if this will spawn spawn. Let's try it, but I don't know if anything will spawn here because it's not a public place and nobody lives here right now, but let's just take a look. Um, otherwise, we might travel to another world. Oh, this is a nice little green place. I don't see any frog holes, but this is a very nice little pondy lake thing very cute. This is a cute little place to visit. Oh, there's like a little golf course over there. I need to get out more and like explore more of the world. <laughs> the Sims world. I'm just pretty focused on what I'm doing and where I'm at. Oh, it looks like things are starting to grow, but there's nothing really to get right now. So I wonder if it will be better if we come back later, but how about you come over here and fish with some sage bait and we'll just do that for a little bit and see if anything pops up. I just don't want to miss any really cool frogs or anything like that just because we were impatient and went too fast um, past areas. But usually I think that the frog places are there already. They just don't have frogs in them yet, but maybe not. We'll just see. Oh, Ace has come home from school and Lee is home from work. I wish Lee would get a promotion already. Good heavens. He's been making the same amount of money for like a long time. Okay, so I'm not seeing anything. We've caught some koi. We will speed up even more while I look around. Oh, a new fish has been caught. That's wonderful. Yep, I don't see any frog spots here. Ooh, oh my gosh, we caught a cow plant berry. <gasps> That's never happened to me before. Oh my goodness, that is very exciting. Oh my goodness, we're gonna have to plant that. <gasps> Ooh, I've never had a cow plant before. That's exciting. I wonder, is there like a plant um, collection? Gardening collection. Oh my gosh, we should do, oh no, good lord, look at all those. Maybe we could try that though, what is this? I mean, obviously we're not gonna get the get to work ones, but we could try to do everything else because these are ones that I think we have to get um, like at work or through work or whatever. We could try to do that. Let's do that, let's go home. And we've gotten a lot of fish, let's go home. I never really thought about that. Gosh, we're like master gardeners. We just need to make some room out in our backyard. Oh my 
gosh, our cute little cow plant. Hopefully nobody dies from our cow plant. Okay, so I think some of these less rare plants, um, we need to buy a plant. Oh, we could go over to the other place to get planter's box. So I think maybe let's go over to the planter's box, which is somewhere over somewhere. Do, 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 do. Where is it? I am retreating. It's over here. Okay, cool. So let's come over here and buy some seeds. We're going to buy three of these. Three of these. We'll buy five of each. Oh, we don't even have to go over there. We just have to select it, I guess. Okay, so let's see what we have gotten. Um, let's open these. Open. 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 Whoop, whoop, whoop. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Oh, everybody's all sitting in here. Just chatting. I can't believe we got that cute little cowberry. It's so cute. I've never grown a cow plant before. Ever. Can you believe that? How long have I been a simmer? That's crazy, right? Okay, so I think that maybe we want to do a little bit of reconstruction in our garden out here. Okay, so what are these? Basil. Um, let's sell the basil. It's like not even very productive. I think that maybe we want to keep one of most of this stuff. I'm going to move our tree ones to the side. So that will be nice. Okay, we can put one basil here and we'll sell this. What are these? Blackberry bushes are pretty productive. What is this? This is a carrot. So we'll put one carrot over here and sell everything else. Um, one onion plant. And we'll sell the rest because I want to grow this other stuff see what happens because it's pretty fun okay we can do one tomato over here and sell the rest of our tomatoes what is this oh chrysanthemums those are actually like really um productive plants like they are worth quite a bit considering but we will still sell them because really all we really need is the lemon fruit and the dragon fruit. The lemon dragon. Um, let's put one of these over here. What are these? Spinach. Blah. Okay, so obviously our dragon fruit we want to keep like a lot of. over in the corner right here and I'm gonna plant it it's gonna be really cute okay then I want oh I need to go back into build mode good lord okay now I want to make the dragon fruit right here and we'll just do two little rows of our dragon fruit Oh, good lord. Okay, right here. Perfect. Okay, so that's going to be perfect. Now, we have all of this other stuff that we can plant. So, 
Oh gosh. glowy on the thing. <laughs> Funny. Okay, so that's going to be good. Um, we need to go back in here. I think that these are trees, right? I think that the, this is a tree. Oh no, they can go close together. Let's see how those spawn. I thought that the bananas were like trees and would get really big, but maybe not. Okay, we haven't ever grown any bluebells. Um, or any mushrooms, actually. Two, three, four mushrooms. Um, and none of the rest of these are actually really rare. Or very exciting. We don't need any sage, no. None of that. Any spinach. We don't need the parsley. Um, apples are not very good. Um, mushrooms are also really not that good. Um, how much are these? Oh, seven dollars. Yes. Okay, so here we've. Let me just make sure that this. We've gotten this in our collection. That we've gotten, yep, the bananas, all of that stuff, perfect, all of it in our collection. Okay, so the grapes are actually worth quite a bit. So we're gonna plant the grapes. We're gonna sell the rest of this stuff. I don't really care about these bananas. I had a whole plan here, but um, we don't actually have to grow them in order for it to complete the fact that we have them. And apples aren't worth that much either. are worth quite a bit actually. Um, apples are kind of worthless. Strawberries too, unless you're trying to have a baby. Um, what is this? Basil? Worth nothing. Bluebells are okay, but not exactly what we want. We don't really need any carrots. We don't need any of this. And these daisies. Nope. Okay. Let's get rid of this stuff. I should try to do this through the night. Um, so let's come have her plant. And hopefully she's going to plant everything. What is that? Our cow plant just moved? Moved. <laughs> oh gosh, because it's huge. Okay. That makes sense. Funny. <laughs> I had no idea. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay, let's breed. Um our frogs. I wish that I could breed more than one couple of frogs at a time. That would be cool. I just want to see what would happen. You know, like, not necessarily just for the money, but just to see, like, you know, if I could breed a whole bunch of frogs with each other. I mean, it makes sense that there's a cooldown on the same pair of frogs, but I think it would just be cool if I could breed multiple sets of frogs at once. Okay, so let's get her needs back up and then um, we will probably get this episode ended. So let's go to the restroom. We're going to open and have something to eat. Oh, we better put this in the fridge. Oh, it's bad. Darn. We didn't eat it very fast. Um, let's grab a serving of fruit and then you need to take a shower and we'll have you head to bed. 
So let's speed this up a little bit and we'll have to fix the dishwasher in the morning. And maybe we can do some more group gardening. <laughs> That'll be really nice. Okay, so come up here, take a shower and go to sleep. Asa has gone to sleep, good heavens, thank goodness. Thank goodness. Sometimes it's almost impossible to get them to go to sleep. Okay, we are gonna be in good shape here. Woohoo! Okay, so this is the perfect place to end this episode of the Drifter Challenge. Um, I'm excited to see how our garden is gonna develop and to get some more plants um, found. I cannot wait. Um, so as always, you can find me in my live channel, twitch.tv slash Zilria. Um, you can also follow me on Twitter. Please do. I'd love to talk to you there at Zilria underscore. Um, and I will catch you on the next drift. Love you to pieces. Bye-bye.